and splash down. Crew 9, back on Earth. This view coming from the WB-57 high altitude plane. And there you see it on your screen, drogue deployment. Drogue descent rate, now there we go. We have visual on four healthy mains. That view was from inside. And as you can see on your screen, we have visual confirmation of splashdown. Dragon Freedom has returned home and NASA astronauts. System safety very down crew nine back on earth boys this view coming from the wb-57 high altitude plane and there you see it on your screen drogue deployment drogue descent rate normal back to planet earth go for recovery personnel to approach Expect personnel alongside in the next few minutes. You can see there they're using an instrument that is basically working to detect if there are any hypergolic noise. This view coming from the WB-57 high altitude plane. And there you see it on your screen, drogue deployment. Drogue descent rate normal. You can hear the crowd here. Splashdown, Crew 9, back on Earth. PM Pacific, 5.57 PM Eastern Time this afternoon. Approximately 17 hours prior to splashdown, Dragon autonomously undocked from the International Space Station, completed a series of departure burns or vapors, come out from the spacecraft. They'll also place harnessing around the spacecraft that are required in order to lift it out of the water. As, go ahead, Sandra. And Dragon Aground is no longer private. Upwind of the spacecraft. The two fast boats have very specific roles. Here we go. We have visual on four healthy mains. That view was from inside. Bring up a company. That view was from inside one of the buckets. And splash down. Crew nine back on Earth. Every personnel to approach. Expect personnel alongside in the next few minutes. You can see there they're using an instrument that is basically working to detect if there are any hypergolic vapors or fumes that are still residing. Don't miss out. Log on to oneindia.com for more updates.